When you see a military Humvee, the first thought that comes to mind is off-road capability. However, when you give a Humvee to someone like Watercar Dave, your capabilities don't end on or off the road. They also extend to the water. So come hang out with us and take a deep dive as Harrison and Dave go for a ride and go in-depth with the details of this Hummer. Let's check it out. Oh, and it's important to mention that this Humvee is not Dave's first water car. He's built hundreds of water cars, just like this Panther that Harrison is standing in front of right now. Check out their website at watercar.com after the video, and you can order one for yourself today. All right, guys, we're back here in Lake Havasu City, Arizona, over at the Islander, and what we have behind us is the infamous water car by Dave. Dave the water car man. So, as you can tell, this thing is not just a truck, it's also a boat. And we get to test out the brand new H1 Hummer. Not the sissy la la ones that you can buy on the street, but an actual surplus military Hummer. Stay tuned. So we're on our maiden voyage with Dave with water car. And the all new Hummer. Pass under these rear seats. All right, we got the protection of the live vest under the seats. I'm up to date on my swimming cart. <laughs> I wear my lightweight never, shoes. You never know. That's right. So how long have you been working on this one? We started this one almost a year ago. And year, we okay. actually were in the design phase for six months. And then we actually bought a Hummer about six months ago yeah. and started working off of that. But what's interesting about the Hummer is what people don't realize is it's all aluminum. Very lightweight so they can drop right. the helicopters. And yet they use these big, thick frames and the suspension and everything is just ridiculous. So you get them off the frame and they're pretty light. And that's what we've done. We're just using the body and basically the running gear and the frame and all the suspension and all the thick coils, all the heavy shit, right. you know, we discard, we don't use. But the thing is like a boat, like an airplane, it's all about power and weight. Exactly. Yeah, same thing with our race cars. Yes. Power to weight. Yeah, yeah, oh yeah, it's absolutely. All right guys, so we're gonna be uh, taking this thing in. Uh... And first we're gonna put her in gear. So we're in gear. Pumps on. And then what we're gonna do is put the, the wheels up. And put the, the, the trim down. You know, that almost reminds me of Disneyland. It, 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 it. <laughs> wow. Except I don't think I had this much fun at Disneyland. Where's the alligators, right? Yeah, exactly. And especially since you're in a Hummer, that's really tripping everybody out. Yeah. Man, the Hummers are respected everywhere in the world. World, yeah, exactly. It's, it's interesting. And now the water. Yeah. <laughs> no doubt about it, you're the most watched boat on the marina. Yeah, we, we get the uh, we get the attention. Yeah, the rock works. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. No, we, that's Where? phenomenal. 
like you could just drive right into town. No, I know. Most fun part. Right? I was gonna say that's yeah, that's that's absolutely it. A little wet, but that's what you expect. Woo! That's right. <laughs> that's right. You guys will love it. I came up right in the middle of the desert over there. Yeah. I mean, that thing looks like it's. Oh, yeah. Covered. The, I mean, it just, and with the four wheel drive, it just straight up. Yeah, absolutely. It's, uh, it's awesome. that's, that was pretty amazing. Really? I've been building airplanes and uh, boats and cars and all my life. I've yeah. probably fixed over. 680,000 cars at, at all of the shops in Southern California. So this was kind of a natural. Yeah. So so it was kind of fun because being involved with boats and you know cars, it's like nobody's really connected the two. Yeah. And uh, now that we have, it's something that's just it's really a lot of fun. And the people all over the world look at this and go, man, I gotta have one. So the yeah. people in Dubai, we got Singapore and Thailand, all these people are going. You know, and it's to me, it's surprising that some else really hasn't done it yeah but the key has been to be able to get the wheels to lift up and the design of the bottom and then being able to put the motor in the rear instead of the front you can see how it wants to nose in in the water yeah, right. can you imagine if the engine was up right there and all that weight so we took and basically took the hummer body and did a 180 on it so it's facing backwards and then kept the motor where it was in the hummer ah. and then connected the uh, Bravo outdrive to it it sounds simple <laughs> yeah, no, yeah, I'm sure it's a but lot of fun. Half a dozen engineers for yeah. about six months it took. But yeah, it's absolutely. All fun. Absolutely. What does this thing weigh right here? This weighs 5,200 pounds. Wow. And, the, and it's all aluminum. Yeah. It's a little less than what a regular hover weighs, um, but with all the marine equipment and everything, uh, you know, you add that and then you subtract, you know, whatever you can that the Hummer didn't really need. Right. So I see it's registered as a boat, not a car? No, you have to register as a car and a boat. Oh, you do? Okay. So you get to pay taxes on the boat, boat. and the car. There you go. And then insurance on a boat and a car. <laughs> and the insurance guys are going, okay, how far under the water do I take it? And then when it's in the land, where do I take, take it? it? So yeah. technically it's 50-50. And so we've got a number of different insurance companies that had trouble with this, and now they've understood. And Sure. And uh, they're... they're Seem to be okay with it. Yeah, absolutely. Well, I think you did a phenomenal job. I think it looks great. It, it performs fantastic. You know, and I even got a free shower out of it. Yeah, you sure did, yeah, man. Right. I enjoyed that. You <laughs> yeah, wonder absolutely. why I kept turning right. <laughs> Good right. job. Great Appreciate meeting. It. Thanks, guys. Thank you Dave. very much. Thank you. Settled now. <laughs>